This is Coyote News. Students arrived on campus to some new artistic scenery this year. Coyote News' Andy Hartman takes us on a tour of the university's updated sculpture walk. Not only has the new semester brought unfamiliar faces to campus, it has also brought some fresh artwork. USD Sculpture Walk has added some new pieces this year. USD President Jim Abbott looked to the Dean of the College of Fine Arts to help with the selection. The beginning of this started um, probably in late or mid-2012 when President Abbott asked me to come and see him with regards to adding additional sculptures to campus. The university works with the Sculpture Walk in Sioux Falls, where hundreds of artists have had artwork featured. Jim Clark, who's the director of Sculpture Walk Sioux Falls, presents us with 20 or 30 potential sculptures, and we select the top six, present them to President Abbott, he gives his approval, and we start to move forward. So far, the Sculpture Walk has been getting great feedback. We've had great comments from everyone, university administrators, faculty, students, alumni I've heard from now commenting how wonderful it is and how much they appreciate all the sculptures we have on campus. The sculptures are made by both local artists and by other artists from around the world. Sculptures are being featured all around campus and there are four sculptures on display in downtown Vermilion as well. For Coyote News, I'm Andy Hartman.